Here we go. Oh, safety first. These bumps are no joke on this road. This is insane. Jeez. <laughs> oh, here's a big hill coming up. Here we go, going up this hill. This corner sucks right here. All right, here we go. This corner is just brutal. I don't know what made people think that normal cars would make it through that. Easy peasy in this truck. <laughs> that was awesome. Wow, Todd took my parking spot. Gonna have to loop around this way. Perfect. <laughs> that was sweet, man. Is this parking? Park brake is on, perfect. What the heck? Coldest night of the year, ain't got nothing on me. Nothing, ain't got nothing. Totally not scared that it's gonna be the coldest night of the year. All right, well, this is kind of crazy, but I kept this a secret from you guys. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day and clicking on today's episode. It's gonna be really crazy. Uh, it's the coldest night of the year coming up. It, we're gonna wake up with snow. Um, it's gonna be snowing, it's supposed to start around 3 or 4 a.m. So by the time we wake up, there'll be snow on the ground. We're camping, we're cooking, and I'm about to show off the brand new 2022 Chevy Silverado 1500 LTD LTZ. This thing is insane. This is a diesel truck. I'm gonna be showcasing this truck for the next couple of videos with you guys and I'm so excited. But I wanted to start off things with a bang and that is camping out of this thing. I don't have my bed set up, nothing like that. I have no idea how I'm going to camp out of this truck tonight, truthfully, but um, we're gonna make it happen because that's what we do on the channel so dude this truck is insane i, I received it yesterday um wasn't able to film anything yesterday but here we are today and i can't wait to show you guys this truck oh my god dude i'm so excited this thing's insane i mean i have a, a f-150 uh single cab with an eight foot bed and it has nothing like crazy in it no technology nothing like absolutely nothing it is a bare bones truck it is a work truck bare bones has a beeper backup sound it was cheap blah 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 it's all i could afford and um chevy hit me up recently and was like hey can we send you a truck and i was like me yeah i guess and they're like cool we'll send it to you keep it for like a week and film some content out of it i was like oh <laughs> This isn't a scam. And then the truck showed up at my house yesterday and I was like, wow, this wasn't a scam. Um, wow. Uh, it's fully loaded, by the way. We got a sunroof. The sunroof is just key. I wish I had one of these suckers. Majestic. And then that little, see that middle window right there that my finger's on? Yeah. I wish I had that. God, this is going to be so much fun showcasing this truck to you guys. It is just going to be the coldest conditions possible for me to do this in, but I don't really care. Um, we're gonna be cooking unreal dinner tonight. Unreal dinner tonight. 
Uh, I had the kayak in the back of this thing. Todd's gonna go catch us some fish while we set up some stuff. Well, hopefully he catches some fish. Fingers crossed. Um, we're gonna do some catch and cook action. Camping action, cooking action, sleeping action. Oh, I'm so exhausted. Um, and yeah, we're just gonna have a freaking day with it. Thank you so much to Chevy for sending me this truck. I can't wait to talk more about it. But for now, I really feel like we should uh, get to the really important part and that is figuring out how we're sleeping out of this truck. Because it's not gonna be in the bed. I can promise you that. I'll be way too exposed in the elements. Unless I had a truck cab, then I would do it. My first time ever backing anything down. I forgot I had the, the yak in the bed, actually, so I gotta back the kayak up. This is so weird. Look at this. The tailgate's down, um, but obviously there's a backup camera on the tailgate, and then look at this view. Like, this is insane. There's like 5,000 different cameras. I really like this one right here. Since the tailgate's down, Parking brake all. Is that how I do it? I think I just turned it off. Okay. Like you can see Todd. That's his car. This thing's sick. <laughs> Look like a little bunny rabbit. Getting the yak out. Am I parking next to you for the night? I don't know where we should park. Do you know? No. I mean, at night, I don't think it'll matter. No. I think for right now, we should keep the circle. Open. Open. Okay. Right? Is that a good idea? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. night we should totally, I don't want you. Especially because you don't have blackout. Yeah. Stuff. You should be. I should, stuff. yeah. In case you need me. I got you, boy. I got to figure out how to turn all these lights on. Cause latch points. Look at all, latch points. Oh yeah, there's like 5,000 latch points in the bed of this truck. It's insane. Like there's just. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 12. 12. 12 that we can see like clearly. There's probably something hidden somewhere. Like this truck's insane. I can't wait to show you guys. Nice setup. Yo, so get out and come. I'm coming. All right, I'm coming. Oh, mattress. You're gonna I be got way comfy. Two of these. They were 25 bucks a piece. So much more comfortable. Yeah, that that's nice. You know how cold? You know it's like the coldest night of the year, right? So <laughs> I also bought. <laughs> Ignored it. I didn't. I bought this. So I could put my heater heater on it, but if Duke's here, then he can't do that. Then I'm gonna need to like turn the car on every once in a while. Let's go make our bed while I crank the heat though, because it's 20 degrees out right now. Ah, I'm just kidding. It's like 30. Bye. Have fun. Later. Later. This man better catch us some food. I'm just kidding, we have food prepared though. Oh, this is gonna be a mess. I gotta organize. Hey, let me showcase this new truck to you guys while it's a disaster and messy. Yeah. Also, look at this. This is a back seat. Storage. Just casual storing on, on the seats. It's on both seats. And then look at the size of this cup holder. <laughs> it's absurd all right i think i have a good idea what's going on i'm gonna empty everything out of this um laundry basket right here that i brought for convenience totally planned and not just pure luck that i now have an idea on how to use it dang it's not gonna fit or i mean oh my god it's perfect so I'm just continuing this platform right here. So last time how I slept in my truck was like at an angle like this and my head was over here. That is perfect. Yeah, buddy.
And this looks so comfy. Storage underneath. Got some propane. I brought my power box, but truthfully, I don't think I'm gonna need it because if I'm sleeping right here, this is right here. Cigarette lighter, USB, everything I could possibly need is right there. So I think I'm honestly gonna be fine, but I did bring it just in case. She fits perfectly. There's a lot of cool stuff that I got going on inside this cooler. I packed really good when it came to food this trip, I'm telling you. Pop it open. We got bread, the secret sauce, another secret sauce down there, some snacks, waters, everything you'd possibly need, but I just really don't want to spoil what we got in here, but it's, uh, it's pretty sick. And I'm actually starving. I completely skipped lunch. I might do that soon. One of my favorite things about this truck is, here's the car keys. Watch this button. Look, both hands are right here. It just opened. What? Hold on. Okay, it's closed, and now I'm gonna go inside the truck and show you guys another way. This is insane. You guys stay right here, and I'll bring another part of you guys inside the truck. You'll see. I'm right here, okay? You guys are also another camera's in the back. I'm gonna click this button right here. Yeah, that just happened. That just freaking happened. This is insane. Now. Another thing that I think is really cool is my truck um, has a step stool to get inside the bed, which is why I love my truck so much. Um, this one just knocked my truck out of the park with the step stool. Watch this. Just, just mm, watch this. Close. I'm gonna click this. Comes down, no hands, I don't need to do anything. Pretty cool. And now right under that button that I just pressed, there's another button and I'm gonna press that. So that weird contraption goes down. So then once that's down, take your hands and you push down right here. And then this is your stepping stool. Look at the size of this. It's insane. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? Just absurd, absurd. And then as Todd and I were talking earlier, there's so many little spots that you can tie rope to. One, two, there's a total of 12 that we counted. Um, it's insane. There's one thing I always wanted my truck to have. It's this right here. Um, yeah, that's a game changer right there. That's a game changer. Now, I don't want to throw too much information at you guys because I still want you guys to enjoy the video of us camping, cooking, and doing our thing in the truck. So, um, while Todd's out there doing his thing, trying to catch some fish, I'm gonna get myself organized in the truck and uh, get ready to start cooking. So, let's do this thing. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the vid. I'm so stoked right now. Sorry, one last thing. My phone's on red right now and I need to charge my phone. Watch this, please. Wireless charging pad. Usually wireless charging pads don't really work when you have a phone case on, but I'm gonna take my phone with a phone case on. I'm gonna place it right on the charging port. It's charging. It's charging right now with the case on that's just insane all right now i'll see you guys in a little bit in a little bit we're waiting for todd he should be out any second the sun's going down how did i do yeah zero white perch striper three any keepers no dang it <laughs> dang it all right are you no, hungry all schoolies yeah but i got plenty of food for us yeah i mean i do too i'm just starving and I really wanted to eat. Well, like pre-dinner, eat, and then like dinner, dinner, you eat later. Perch. You yeah, I really, I really wanted white perch again. It's so good. It would have been great. You know, you suck. I tried. My hands are really cold. Yeah, it's freezing. I took a nap by accident and with the windows by down. Accident. With the windows down. Yeah. By accident. Yeah. Yeah. Happens to the best of us. I'll, I'll leave you some food. Are you leaving right now? 
I should, right? Yeah, go now um, before Time's traffic gone. like kicks up. Oh, and it's gonna be traffic anyway. So. Yeah. Todd just threw all this stuff in my truck. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, food. I'm gonna make uh, food. Uh, Pre-dinner meal. Yep. Watch this. This is my mom's famous meatballs that everyone's obsessed with. Yeah. We gotta warm this up real quick. This is a uh, good old Portuguese bread, the best bread ever made. Next to ciabatta bread, obviously. Ciabatta bread just makes the cut every time. This smells so freaking good, man. Yeah, buddy. I didn't bring anything to clean my pants. That'll do. <gasps> it's so cold. <laughs> Dang. Well, first meal out of the Chevy meatball sub. Thanks, Mom. I know you're watching. Appreciate it. It's gonna be delicious. Pre-dinner. I didn't eat lunch, okay? A nice home cooked meal. Get it? Ha <laughs> ha. dog, this handsome fella, the cutest pit bull you'll ever meet in your life. We love him. And then, uh, Chad also has got the burgers going. Rocker bowl. Where'd you get the onion rings from? The gas station where I got you your Tylenol. Oh, thanks, dude. Oh, yeah. They're, they're already freezing, because it's freezing. Dude, it's so cold out. We're gonna die tonight. I have a cold. Yeah, you, you'll be kind of a dude. Get out of baby. You're so handsome. How much more comfortable this is. With Duke? No, with the extra mattresses. With so both. Duke and the mattress. Oh. I'm having a sip. Yep. This is, looks delicious. <laughs> <laughs> How are your meatballs? Why? Yeah, buddy. In the back of the Chevy. Let's go. Oh, what is this? Mayo? Oh, gross! I thought that was Me much. too! No! Ew. Oh, that's the worst thing that's ever happened to me. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get that out of there for you. Oh, gross. Sorry, <laughs> right, eat my life. I was like, oh yeah, dude, mustard. Mayo, dude, mayo is the worst. Ketchup mustard is key on a burger. No, I'll never put mayo on a mayo burger. Mayo sucks. 
so much, dude. Oh, they ruined my day. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Kinda. I don't know where the other one is. Oh. Mmm. Turn out done burger. It looks a, it looks wonky, but it's good. Mmm. Is the Chevy more comfortable than my F-150 to sleep in? Yes. So much more room. Like, it's pretty insane, but what are you gonna do, man? Well, while we're, we're sitting here, just hanging out, the two of us, let me tell you guys a little bit more about this truck because you don't know a lot about this truck and we're sleeping in it, which it feels wrong. So let's talk for a sec. One of the coolest things that made me want this truck for camping is there's built-in Wi-Fi and there's built-in Wi-Fi with their own hotspot that seven people, if they wanted to, if you had seven people, could connect to at once. You got the wireless charging pad that I showed you guys earlier, which is unreal. So pretty much, this Duramax, it's a 3.0L turbo diesel engine, and it gives you 22 mile per hour in the city and then 26 on the highway, 277 horsepower. And my favorite part of this entire truck is the fact that this bad boy can tow a max capacity of 9500 pounds. That's the capability of this truck, unreal. So it's an auto stop and start technology. So I've been realizing at lights, um, the truck shuts off. <laughs> it's at first it was trippy, but uh, it's, it's really freaking cool. I love it. And then if you can't tell, it is quite a quiet truck, but it is super powerful. So I'm, in I'm just in love with it. It comes with Apple and Android CarPlay. So for your Bluetooth lovers, there you go. Comes with eight camera angles, which I showed you guys when I was um, messing around earlier in the start of the video. I only showed you, I think, three out of the eight. It's pretty surreal. There's just so many cool features about this truck, man. I mean, it's crazy to look at my truck, a bare bones F-150, and then look at this truck. It's a very trippy experience, but something that I'm very grateful for. Very, very grateful for. I'm gonna shut off the lights for now and just kind of relax. It's nice to trek camp. It's it's just a way to unwind, truthfully. Just a way to unwind. <laughs> well, I just did a live stream on Instagram, and now I'm pretty much set and done for the night. <laughs> um, the truck's off. Um, took off a couple layers of my ice fishing bibs on. My blue ice fishing bibs. So, I'm pretty layered up right now. Let's check the degrees. What, how cold is it? I mean, I just highly doubt you guys can see that, but actually, it feels like temp right now is 25. Um, ow! <laughs> oh, I just dropped my floor on my face! And that is because it is 25. So it's gonna start snowing at 10. I think that's a lie. Um, but yeah, then there's chance of snow for when you and I wake up. Which is pretty exciting. Snow on Christmas Eve. Moral of the story. Oh, sorry. Is it 9.32? I'm gonna go to bed. I feel like my hat's messed up. I even feel it. Okay. I'm gonna go put on like some meditation music, background stuff. And I'm gonna go to bed. Good night. I love you guys. Tomorrow morning, we making waffles. I want waffles so bad. Chevy, I love you. Chevy, this is such a beautiful truck. Okay, good night. I love you guys. It is so freaking cold. It's so cold. 
It's so cold. Not only that, but we're snowed in. <laughs> the truck's covered in snow, all the windows. I think I'm gonna start the truck because of how cold it is. It's 6.30 right now. Um, I'm just gonna start the truck and probably go back to bed. Let's snow. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> Oh my god, it is so cold. All right, time to go turn the truck on. At least possible drive with care. <laughs> it is so cold. Ah, back in the sleeping bag. <laughs> Hello. Hey. Hey. The magical winter wonderland. It's so pretty outside. Yeah, it's like the perfect amount of snow. I know, I'm stoked. Um, how did you sleep? I slept great. I had to turn the car on probably like once an hour, I would say. And it would get hot really fast, and then I'd turn it off. And it, the heat would last forever, because like all the windows boarded up, and then with Duke and I in here, I didn't turn the truck on one la once last night. <laughs> what? Yeah, I it turned off and I fell asleep. And then I woke up at six, like pretty much on the dot. And I just was freezing to death. Hilarious. Like I just slept there the whole night. I don't know. I have to sh so bad. <laughs> yeah, go in the woods. In the woods? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't have, I don't have any TP. Shoot. So what? You gonna? Are you gonna leave now? I I can scoot right up to the um, gas station and scoot right back. Oh yeah. Okay. I mean. Because I am too uncomfortable to literally move right now. Okay. So go do that and don't get stuck in the snow on the hills over there, though. Luckily, it looks like there wasn't a lot of snow. No, I mean, it's definitely not a lot of snow, but you never know, so just be careful. Yeah. Alright, go enjoy your morning sh and I, um, when you get back, we can make some breakfast. Alright, later. Once Todd gets back from his, uh, <laughs> emergency bathroom run, um, We'll start making some breakfast and whatnot. And I'm pretty excited because breakfast is gonna be amazing and it's still snowing out. It's just, Merry Christmas. It's Christmas Eve, I know, it's not Merry Christmas. But by the time you guys are watching this, it's post Christmas. So hopefully your Christmas was good. Anyways, I love you guys. And the by the time Todd gets back, the, um, the sun should be up. Because the sun's not up right now. It doesn't get up for another 10 minutes. It's like barely light out, so. All right, keep you guys updated. Put this bad boy in reverse. Look at all these freaking camera angles. The tailgate's down, but the camera angles are just so cool, dude. Um, but Todd's not behind me right now for the obvious reason. He went to the bathroom, so I'm gonna back out now. Move spots just a little bit. <laughs> God, it's so beautiful out. Definitely uh, got snowed in a little bit, but I'm not mad. Oh my God, look how beautiful. Like seriously, Merry friggin' Christmas. And then this is a front camera. This is the front of the car. <laughs> like, are you kidding? The side, that's pretty cool. I like these two angles right here. Yeah, buddy. Oh, I gotta fix my makeup. Oh my God, look at my face. Looks like a black eye. <laughs> I think we got the wrong holiday because last time I checked, it is not Thanksgiving. Oh my God. Run, 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 run. Oh my God, there's...
What? That thing is huge. Look at that one. They weren't really like scared of me. They didn't care, weirdos. Like, you're kidding. Look how nice this truck is. Gosh. Jeez. The tailgate's pretty messed up. Messed up. Yep. We didn't think that one through at all. <laughs> that's no, oh, that's not good. Good snow. You gotta get out of here, like, kind of quick. Why you're scared? It was slightly difficult, but you... it and it's continuing to snow. So I'm not like freaked out, like, oh my God, we have to leave right now. But I, another like two hours. Oh yeah, we just need to cook some breakfast and then. get breakfast, yeah. Yeah, once we cook breakfast, we're fine. Yeah. All right. Ah. You wanna see what we got for breakfast? You wanna see what we got for breakfast? <laughs> Oh, please don't be frozen. Oh, nice. Okay, it's not frozen. Here's our waffle mix that I made last night. Uh, well, not last night, but before we came, because I was smart. Um, and then waffle maker. <laughs> okay, hold on. I think this is actually gonna work though. I brought the waffle maker to test the Chevy to its full capabilities. Like my waffle maker? I don't know. I mean, I can. But I want to see if this is going to fit right here. Nah. That's sick, dude. Yeah. Okay. And then in order to turn that on, I think there's this switch in, in the truck to turn the power on back there. Which is this one. I think. We will find out. <laughs> it's on. Oh yeah. I kind of want to just make it inside the truck though. I'm so cold. I'm going to make it in the truck. we doing it. Waffles in the, inside the truck. Let's do this. Please That's work. Nice. Please work. Please work. This thing pops out at you when you open the damn It's door. working. <laughs> it's warming up. Welcome to my fancy oh, truck. Get the fuck out. There's so much room in here. I know. It's ridiculous. Crazy. Is it hot? Christmas. It's it, getting there. All right, cool. Yeah, once that blue light goes away is when it means it's ready to put the pancake right. mix in. Blue light means heat. Yeah. Oh my God. And we're getting it with the snowflake on it. There's a sick. You're a snowflake. What the heck? What the hell? <laughs> I am not. You kind of are. Why? It's another way of saying yay. Um, <laughs> so, we're about to put it in. No, that sounds wrong. We're about to put it in though. <laughs> For the first time. For the first time, <laughs> taking the truck's waffle virginity. <laughs> oh, I can't open this bag. Oh, okay. You know what you should do? You should just cut a hole. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I, now that I opened it, kidding. I regret it's, it. It's like, it's too much. You brought too much. If you brought just enough, what, how, what am I gonna measure? Cut a hole right in the corner, like a. <laughs> Was like, I gonna measure a waffle maker? Okay, well, here I mean, we go. You, this is a tiny waffle maker. Well, I didn't want to bring a full size one. Is that good? That should be. That's way too much. Is that way too much? It might be. Let's find out. 
Yeah, waffle number one winning. And then the blue I. Blue light went back on, so bad thing. Mm, no, Does it, it go just, on and off now? Yeah, when it goes off, that means our waffle is done. Oh, because that just took the temperature down big time. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, dude, we're making waffles out of a diesel truck right now. Here's our waffle. Look at that. We're making freaking waffles out of a truck. Are you guys kidding me right now? Are we kidding? Welcome back. Oh, the waffle's done. The light just went off. Ooh, it's spewing out the side. I knew I put too much in there. Can you cut it? If you want. I have a knife. Ah! <laughs> so this is the star side and then the waffle side. Beautiful. Glorious. Here you go. You want the first waffle? Here you go. Oh, I was going to say we need some butter. We got butter. And we got maple syrup. This is so sick, dude. Who else is doing it like we are? No one. Ain't no one. <laughs> baby. How does it taste? Ooh, truck waffles. Rate it one through ten. Uh, the for truck waffles. For truck waffles. Truck waffles at ten. This is my first ever truck waffle. It's <laughs> gonna be hard to beat this one. It's gonna be real hard to beat that truck waffle. How many do you want? I'll we'll probably have two truck waffles. All right, I'll make you another truck waffle. That I will do. I would really appreciate it if you went over to Becca's channel and, and made some like really stupid comment about how this is her truck now. No! And, like tell her things she needs to like upgrade to this truck and like just dumb stuff. Cause everyone just literally thinks favor. this is my truck and it's, it's, it's just, I, ah, uh, it's not my truck. People just don't understand the concepts, you know? It's like, no. Chevy gave me this truck for a week. And they heard Chevy gave me this truck because that's just how their brains work. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, Chevy gave Holy you a crap, brand new Becca, truck? You're why not didn't even... they give me a truck? Well, you're spoiled now. Like, damn. Yep, just it's suck. for a week. It's so they could advertise. Okay, uh, so my- And they gave it to her Christmas week, so they literally took two days out of the equation. Yeah. But. Because we're savages, right now, guys, it is Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas, Becca. Yeah, Merry Christmas. Here's my waffle. <laughs> she loves waffle. I really love waffles. <laughs> and pancakes. Twa waffle. Okay, I'm going to eat my waffle. I just finished cooking. Um, maple syrup. I'm happy that the waffle mix didn't freeze last night. That was my concern. I was scared, but <clears throat> it didn't. You didn't put more butter on it? Oh. What's wrong with you? I just really want to eat it. I'm pretty sure I, don't I, care. I could eat a waffle without syrup mm. if I had butter. Mm, no other way but around. But the opposite, I can't do. Okay, first bite. Oh, it's falling apart. <laughs> Truck waffles. Truck waffles for life. <laughs> Truck waffles. Holy crap. What? That's sick, dude. Oh, so when did that light turn off? Just now. Ah. Wanna get your waffle? Oh, look at him. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pretty little weight. Oh, this is your camera. <laughs> oh, Lola. <laughs> right? Yeah. Nailed it. Because ultimately, this is the best. <laughs> this is the best truck I've ever had. Dude. Jay! <laughs> Jay! <laughs> <laughs> you had it out, homie? Oh, yeah. You hey, too? Yeah, I'm gonna leave. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. I'm just kidding. I'll see you before the New Year. We're going ice fishing. Yeah. Love you. Love you. Have a safe drive back. Hopefully you don't get stuck. That was so much fun catching and cooking other things. <laughs> catching and cooking things that weren't caught. Um, do you want to go first or me go first? You go first. Okay, yep. Bye. Love you. Come on, Chevy Silverado.
Don't let me down, oh. Okay. I'm gonna go first through the treacherous drive. It's pretty crazy. All right, let's do this. How good is this truck gonna do in snow? Gotta find out. It's that snow that, uh, it's like, it's not necessarily like sticky snow, so it's not the best snow to drive in, to say the least. But we're gonna make it happen. Ah! All right, Scary Hill Uno right here. It's not really that big of a hill, for this truck at least. There we go. Oh, okay. Good. Now it's, oh, oh God. Oh God, oh God. We slipped for two seconds. If we stayed any longer, Todd would, would not be able to make this. All right, here we go. <laughs> this is why you buy a truck, folks. We got one more big hill coming up. We kinda, we were pretty deep into the woods, but after this hill, we're on like back roads. This is like not even back roads. So far, Todd's good. I just look behind me. I'm not even on four wheel drive right now. <laughs> that is one scary hill. Oh, holy crap. There's, is Todd's truck, do you guys see Todd all the way back there? Is he really gonna make it? Oh my God, he made it. I just saw his tire spin, but homeboy freaking made it. Oh my God, it's chaos right now, just pure chaos. There's this, we're on a hill right now. This is the last hill on like a back road until we get into hopefully the paved roads, but uh, so far, so freaking good, man. This truck is so good. Like, I, I, it's cool that they sent it to me this time of year because I'm really pushing the truck to its limits. We're, we're towing a kayak right now. We're doing this, we're doing that. Camping in it, cooking in it, doing everything. This is just so freaking cool. Oh, dude, they didn't even pave the freaking roads yet. Of course they didn't. Well, Todd made it. Yeah, baby! Todd's right behind me. His little uh, Fiat made it. Oh, he, his tires just spun. Hell yeah! Yoo yoo! Freaking did it. That's squad, that, that is squad goals right there. Todd made it, I made it, let's freaking go. Well, thank God we can end this video off on a high note because Todd just made it. Um, more of the story is uh, this truck's beautiful. We're gonna be having a lot of fun on this. We're going on a cool ice fishing adventure in this truck too. So uh, get ready. Seriously, this is going to be a lot of fun. So uh, thank you guys for clicking on this episode, taking the time out of your day. Hope you guys have such an amazing holiday. Um, spend time with your family, enjoy yourselves. And uh, yeah, I just appreciate you guys for all the love and support. If you guys want to ask any questions about the truck, drop them in the comments down below. Uh, I'm not a truck expert, but I can answer some some questions for sure. Um, I slept like a freaking baby last night, man. I'm just so thankful right now. I'm feeling feeling really like all bubbly inside, just like happy and content with life. Everything's so good right now. Um, just gotta be thankful and uh, have a positive outlook on things, and good things come your way. So that's all I got for you guys. Thank you so much for clicking on today's episode. Thank you. To Chevy for uh, lending me this truck. Hopefully, <sighs> hopefully, you guys consider sending me it for free, for long term, forever. I'm just kidding. Kidding? Huh? Oh, here are the plows. Oh, of course, the plows are behind me. Cause why would they be in front of me? It's fine. I have a truck. Anyways, I love you guys. Thank you for all the love and support. You guys are amazing. Keep being you. Keep, keep keep doing you things and whatnot and I'll catch you beautiful people next time. I'm driving so I can't do my fist pump out so I'm gonna slam you guys into my head. Peace out. Mwah.